Hey everyone, it's Brian, and if you're looking for the top four reasons to be a math major, well, you're at the wrong video. It's this video right here. Those are the four reasons you should be a math major, but these are the top four reasons, or at least my top four reasons, as why you should not be a math major. I think some of us sometimes, including myself, I did this, I chose the wrong major in college, at least at first, I think I did. And so I'd like to help some of you avoid the trap of the math major. It's not a trap if you choose it for the right reasons, but there are some wrong reasons as to why you should definitely not choose this major. So here we go. Reason, reason number one is that you don't know what you want to do when you graduate. And this is, this. I guess you could apply this to any major, right? You don't want to pick any major just because you don't really know what you want to do. I mean, I, I guess that if you don't know what you want to do, maybe, maybe a math major sounds good. I'm willing to bet a math major is a pretty high price to pay just for not nailing down what you want to do when you graduate. So if you do know what you want to do when you graduate, like maybe you want to be a math teacher, then yeah, absolutely, go for the math degree. But if you have no real idea, maybe you want to be a teacher, maybe you want to work in a business, maybe you want to work in human services. I mean, you don't want to just pick a math major as as just because you don't really know. Because the reason is, is it's a hard degree. A lot of the times, you know, obviously it depends where you go. But a math major can be challenging. I mean, it was very challenging for me. So you don't want to just pick it out of the blue. Number two, you also don't want to be a math major because you think it sounds cool or it sounds impressive. Because I will tell you a couple things. I definitely thought being a math major sounded cool. I thought I was pretty cool. I mean, come on. But I also thought it would be really impressive. And it turns out, uh, I don't really think anyone cares. I, just because you tell people you're a math major, <laughs> they're not really gonna, I don't think they're really gonna care so much. Maybe some people will, but that is a horrible, horrible reason to choose a major. I remember having discussions with my classmates and they were like, oh man, if you want to pick a hard major, pick a math major. You know, it would be really tough and time consuming and hard and, and wow, you're a math major. And you know, maybe some people think that, but at the end of the day, it really doesn't matter. And that's a really bad reason to get sucked in just because you think it's hard and impressive. You don't want to pick a major based on that. Number three, and this is a very common one in my experience when people want to be math majors because they really like calculus, you know? They do well in calculus, it, it makes sense to them, they love formulas and derivatives and integrals and, oh, calculus is, is great, I wanna do more of this, I wanna be a math major. And then they find out when they take their first real analysis class or their first proof class that pure mathematics is absolutely nothing like calculus. Well, it's not true, it's not nothing like calculus and it's not like calculus never shows up. But once you really hit those pure, abstract, actual math classes, you know, in your junior and senior year of college, you're not really doing the same type of stuff anymore. You know, you're basically drawing on definitions and, and theorems and facts and coming up with new results. You are reasoning analytically and you're proving statements. That's really, that's really the bulk of what you're doing. Unless you're doing something very applied, you know, a much more applied mathematics degree, that might be a little bit more like calculus, but a pure mathematics degree is, is much different. It's gonna be totally different than calculus. So I've tutored many students who really enjoy calculus. They're thinking about being a math major. And then I, I would show them some of my work, you know, I'd show them some books that I have, tell them what it was like. And to be honest, I think some were a little surprised. I think some just didn't really know what to think. I think some people were, more excited, that is what they wanted. So just make sure that if you are gonna be a math major, you at least take a look at what your future entails and don't be intimidated by it. it, can be very intimidating, but just know that an actual math major's work is going to be different than what calculus and algebra and all the classes you've taken before, it's gonna be different than all of that. And the last reason to not be a math major is because you want an extremely high paying job right out of college. I'll tell you what, you can get some very nice paying jobs with a math degree right out of college. Maybe you work for the government as a mathematician. I think it might be a little competitive, but you can be compensated pretty well. If you become a teacher, depending on where you teach, depending on what level and what kind of certification you get, you could probably be rewarded pretty well for that. 
Now, if you're looking to make six figures right out of college, I don't think a math degree is for you. I think if your sole goal is money for your degree, so you can always look up the job statistics of average starting salary by major, and math might be, you know, I don't know, it changes from year to year, it might be in the top 10. But I know for me, when I got out of school, my best option was to become a math tutor part-time. And you know, it was, it was a good hourly rate, but I didn't work a lot. And you know, it was fine. I liked it a lot. It, it, for, for what it was, it was great. But now, if you do think the math degree is for you, again, you can click right here or somewhere around here to find my top four reasons as why you should be a math major. Maybe you can mix and compare these videos, but if you have any of the reasons, bad reasons to be a math major, I'd love to hear them in the comments below. I really appreciate you watching this video until the end, and I hope you have a great day.